What's going on YouTube? So, I, uh, I've been waiting to do this how to train your trail dog. Kind of like a segment. I'm going to do, I don't know how many videos, maybe five or six videos. Or I guess e episodes of how to train your trail dog. So, I wanted to uh, start from the very beginning. Um, and uh, show you guys how to start introducing your dog to uh, commands, um, the bike, and then being along the bike, and then eventually we'll get him out onto the trails. And uh, as you guys know, I had had Atlas before Kai. Um, he ripped the trails, and we rode thousands of miles together all over America. And uh, he passed away, but. Um, and now we got uh, our boy Kai. Um, so I wanted to do a little uh, tutorial on, on how to train a trail dog. So here's Kai. <laughs> he, uh, he's five months old. Well, he'll be five months old in a week. And so he's just getting to that time where uh, we can really start getting him out on the trails. But for... Uh, for a while, maybe for like the next two weeks to a month, we're just gonna do like a bunch of uh, leash and uh, bike training like around the neighborhood. And basically that'll get him used to the bike, uh, what the bike does, and uh, and get him used to like the um, commands with the bike, along with uh, building up his stamina a little bit. And so yeah, we're going to jump right into that. Um, first thing we're going to do is put a harness on them and uh, then get the bike ready to go. You got to be good at uh, riding with one hand because the whatever hand you're better at holding, you got to have a leash with him on it. Like I said, he's a puppy, so it's, it's not too hard. He's, they're, they're, he's not too big yet, but he... Uh, it's good to start uh, getting them, getting them good with the obedience and the different words you want them to know, like uh, like look, uh, come here, um, stay, go. Uh, there's just a few of the words. But anyways, let's uh, let's jump right into it and um, kind of give you guys the first video of what to start doing um, with your trail dog. So here we go. All right, so we got us a, a harness, which um, definitely helps them from getting choked. And they can put their, their body weight into the, their chest and, 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 and pull with their chest instead of their, their neck. And he is excited to go. All right, boy, come over here. Come here, sit, sit, sit. You stay, stay. Stay. Good boy. Yeah, Kai for being a German short-haired pointer puppy is as anyone that's ever owned one, they're they're wild and he is pretty on point and definitely uh that definitely listens. So yeah, what's cool about this is they can pull from here. So definitely helps keep the uh, the strain off their throat and their neck. And then um, you can also kind of guide them around a little better. <laughs> All right, boy. So uh, let's go get the bike and, and do some exercises. All right, boy. Let's, uh... Hold on. Yeah, ever since Kai was a little boy, he uh, he's already been around bikes and he knows he knows like what they are. So he's definitely not scared of them. Um, getting into the the hang of it. All right, so I, I like to use my uh, my right hand um, as my dominant hand for holding the leash, and then you got a good braking power. And I like to keep the seat down so you're. Um, you're not top heavy. If something were to go wrong, you can 
put your weight down and press the front brake and not go flying over the handlebars. So all right, we're gonna we're gonna warm up. So yeah, I've kind of waited till he's about five months old to uh, start getting him into the, the rhythm of it. Basically, to help him be a little more fit than, than a clumsy puppy. But you can see how he's already kind of getting the, the hang of it. Good boy. So when you come up to stop signs, you want to you want to make them stop and come to a dead stop stop and all these things you just want to repeat over and over and over again and it helps them uh really learn okay right, come on we're going this way this way good boy good boy come on let's go let's go Good boy. Good boy. All right. We're going to turn right here, boy. Go right. Go right. Good boy. Good boy. See? And then the different things you do, they'll pick up on. But you got to speak it. And they get used to it. Come on, boy. Yeah, these dogs definitely like to be worked and they like to be commanded and they like to know what you want them to do. Good boy. All right. So this is a little introduction into uh, getting them going. Getting them familiar with everything. You gotta go potty. Come on, go potty. Go potty. It's good too when they're puppies to uh, force them to take a little break, take a little breather, because uh, a German Shorthaired Pointer will literally run themselves to death, literally. Um, but yeah. So one thing I, I like to do too at first is like to stop, stop, stop. Good boy. All right, go, go, go. All right, stop, stop, stop. Good boy, Kai. And again, um, putting commands into your actions helps them really pick up on what to do and what you want them to do. Go, go boy, go. Go boy. All right, so we're gonna get him at a full sprint and then we're gonna stop. Good boy. All right, ready? Stop, stop, stop. Good boy. Guy's a really fast learner. He's um, he's he's been picking up on all kinds of stuff really quick. And basically, yeah, you wanna you wanna do this with them and pick them up slowly for about a month. And then you can take them on to the next progression. This will be the next edit that I make. Come oh on, boy. So also, one thing you want to keep in mind is to uh, keep the, uh, the, the leash short because they are puppies. So they get distracted sometimes. You don't want them to run into the bike. And if the leash is short, you can control them better. And it helps them lead on what they want them to do. But uh, thanks for joining in, guys. Sure appreciate it. Like and subscribe to Chair. And be waiting for the next episode of How to Train Your Trail Dog to come out. All right, y'all. We will see you soon. Woo! Say bye, Kai. <laughs> Say bye, Kai.